Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Welcome back to Cook and Share. I love snacks and these tacos are incredibly delicious, especially on a Friday night or a Saturday. Served up with this guacamole sauce, some sour cream. You're going to love them, so let me walk you through it. So to kick things off here, what I've got is about a pound of ground beef. And I'm just going to kind of break this up and brown it. So what I've done here is drained a little bit of the fat off. Now I'm going to add in a small chopped onion and three cloves of garlic. And I'm just going to sauté this for a few minutes. After a couple of minutes, two tablespoons of taco seasoning. And I just bought this at the store. You can make your own if you like, too. And of course some salt. And some ground black pepper. Mmm, I just love pepper, guys. Give it a stir, just for a few minutes. And this is getting really taco-ish, it just smells incredible. Okay, I'm going to kill the heat and it's time to build our tacos. So what I've got here are some taco shells, and I just kind of picked these up at the store. They're a hard shell, but you can use the soft if you like. Okay, let's put the ground beef in. Mmm, this looks and smells so good. Next up, some shredded cheese. And of course, you can always use the uh, cheese of your choice. Some shredded lettuce. Tomatoes, or tomatoes, however you want to say it. A dollop of guacamole. This is entirely up to you, but I just love this. Another dollop of sour cream. Mmm, just looks incredible. And last but not least, some squeezed lime, just to bring out that freshness. And there you have it guys, our homemade tacos, incredibly delicious, and you make these in about 15 minutes. Okay, let's give these a taste test. Mm. These are incredible, guys. You can never buy anything in the store better than this. Mm. The guacamole sauce, the seasoning, just incredible. You gotta make this. For this recipe, head on over to cookandshare.com. All kinds of cool snacks and stuff over there. Thanks for watching, thanks for subbing, and see you next time. Thank you.